Hey, what is up? So I'm out here testing the Blackmagic camera app, a few updates that came out yesterday. And I noticed something with the vertical video. I mean, in this app, there is a option, enable vertical video. So if you want to shoot vertical, you have to select this option. If you don't select that, if you have it off, you actually can shoot vertical but have a horizontal video but it crops into the image and i don't think that most people are aware of that you can shoot vertical and uh, look like any other tourist shooting that way but you don't get the full width of the video the no full sensor you basically yeah you, you get cropped in so i have vertical video on and this is what i get this is the shot and now when i flip this now i have a vertical video basically uh, but yeah so let's switch this off so what happens now is basically this but as you can see and now you have a crop in view i didn't change anything so the setting is the same you have to be aware and that is with all lenses right so I'm switching to 30, 13. now this is my vertical video basically now i get like the fit of view of the 24 that i had before and this is the wide angle view so yeah they crop in in a way this mode doesn't make too much sense kind of so keep that in mind if you shoot horizontal content in vertical mode it crops in quite a bit anyway that's it just a quick one i have a long list of videos on my list <laughs> real work uh, gets in the way and also like i had a ssd speed test video prepared but then uh, samsung just announced a new drive so i ordered that one to have that in the test as well to see if it's really faster than the t7 on a mac for example so that will be soon i have the viltrox monitor review um, uh, that is a bit too long and the v mount also a new microphone is coming yeah so and yeah i guess um, that's it thanks for watching and see you in the next one or not uh, back to work